Hey, good morning friends. This is Abhishek from TechVirus and today I'm here with another video where I will show you how you can control your mobile device using a laptop. Like you can control entire mobile screen, any application, any services using your laptop or desktop. Just using this free software called TeamViewer. It's available free on net and you can go to this site called www.teamviewer.com and you need to come on this and you have to click on start full version it's free so once it is downloaded you need to install this i have just downloaded this application i'll show you how to install this so in folder i'll just double click on this now uh, once you start the setup it will ask you for the few basic configurations so in this you have to select the personal non-commercial use and basic installation and this click accept and finish so this will install team viewer on your laptop it's a small software that won't take much time okay so once it is finished uh, installation then you need to provide few information in this particular window this window will come up automatically once the installation is completed okay so on the left hand side you have your id your uh, password this is uh, id where you need to give it to some other person if you want this laptop where i have just installed this laptop to be controlled and here this is the partner id means like if you want to control any other laptop or any mobile device using this laptop so and the third one is you can configure your account and you can set up all your devices laptop mobile desktop on just one click you can access any of them so I'll not go into this uh, setup of uh, sign-in process I'll just tell you how you can control your mobile so let me quickly show you how you can install the software which is required in mobile device to control it okay so you just need to go to play store and you have to search this software called teamware quick support so this you can see the second option team viewer quick support you have to just click on this and install it's approximately 5.4 MB so it won't take much time to install so let's see okay yeah it's done it's now it installs and it'll show you this uh, desktop icon or let me open from here okay now if I click on this quick support Here, wait for a few seconds. Your ID will be generated in one or two seconds. So this is my ID 506-171-189. What I need to do is I need to put in in this partner ID. So I'll enter the same number which is on mobile. 506 171 189 now let me show you how does it happen so I'll click on connect partner computer now see here it's asking for acceptable or rejection so you would like to allow access from 77086 so you see this is the my ID 86 and this is the same thing it's asking here so if I say allow, now you see on the desktop, you have got the dashboard where you can see all the information about the mobile. It shows about CPU, RAM, battery, storage and other details of the mobile like which version this is Samsung Galaxy S4 and Android version, all those things will show. Now, uh, there are other options also like you can see here in the menu you have screenshot if you want to take a screenshot of your mobile device what is happening right now 
and you can do it then you can check all the apps what all apps you have if i click on this it will show all the apps which is installed in my mobile so there are a few other settings and so now let's me let me go to the uh, remote control option on top left hand side if you see here this is remote control if i click on this it will open a window and again it will ask for the confirmation so i have to do a confirmation allow once i allow it will show you the desktop or the screen mobile screen of my uh, screen of the mobile so let's see in laptop you will look it will look like this and here this is my mobile okay so you can see now if i close this i'll go back no i don't have to go back i have to do cancel i have to go just press home button it's minimized in the back now you see same this is my mobile and this is my laptop you see you can actually getting all the screen displays on your laptop now i will not touch this mobile i will control it via mouse if you see my mouse is there if i click on this time buddy let me open this application if i double click on this you see on the left hand side it has opened the same thing okay if i want to go back i just come down and i have to press this back button press, press, press back now i have to come back you see so this is how i'm controlling my entire mobile if i want to go home if i click on home it will take me to home see if i'll go to dial number i'll go, go back dialer then i can go back also take me back i'll go to applications it'll take me to applications if i hold the button and i'll drag it then it swipes so this is very simple and very effective application suppose if you have a mobile somewhere else and you want somebody to tell something or somebody's mobile you want to teach them something or you want to train them on some application then you can very easily use this application from your desktop and you can control their mobile i hope you like this video and thank you for watching have a nice day bye bye